Hey guys, it's Judy, and um, this video is a video response to um, Jen at My Purply Life. Um, this Actually, I was tagged by Nadine. Hi, Nadine. She's Nadine um, TX here on YouTube. So this is, I don't know if it's clear. I'm showing it to you on my phone. So there were questions. Show us your washi tape collection. Um, so get ready. I have like three, two full drawer, two and a half full drawers. <laughs> so here goes. Nadine knew, knows I am a washi freak and I am just so addicted to washi. I'm addicted to a lot of things, but um, washi is definitely one of them. So here goes my collection. So here's a bunch. These were the some of the freckled fawn ones. Let me try to zoom in. Um, these are some of the freckled fawn ones I've got. And I'm sure you'll see some of these packs I have not opened yet. Um, but some I have used a lot of. So, um, so like I said, these are the freckled fawns. One of my favorites is this, but I haven't used yet. But I definitely will. Um, and this was in that grab bag, the $5 grab bags. So, I don't know how good it's focusing. There we go. It's like the little triangles, because triangles are really in now, I think. Um, so, one tip I had, had um, shared with you guys is putting, like, some are part of collections. So, like, I do a little tag and I group them together so I know where I got them and what collection it is um, just so um, if someone wants to know or if I run out um, it's hard to run out of washi I think I haven't run out of any one but um, let's say if you do run out then you know exactly where you got them um, and of course chevron one so the this is just one of those drawers I got at Michael's the, the one with the different drawers that you pull out um, but anyway, this is how I store my washi, and, um, got a lot of stuff. I have a son, so I love, I, I just love stars. These are some of my favorites. Um, another favorite is this one, and this is the heart one that, um, says love all over it in the grid. Oh, so that's one that I like. And also another favorite is the heart um, clouds. That's really one of my favorites for cards or layouts. Um, I also really like the words ones. You know, the ones that have sayings. I love this one. I'm going to say I love all of them. <laughs> I'm not, no joke. And this is a live, laugh, love one. And honestly, I have a bad memory of who makes what, but <laughs> I can, um, so, and there's a bunch of these. Um, this is not the washi tape, this is like the Target tape tape, so. And just love the camera one. Um, the butterfly ones, numbers. This is one of my favorites, too. Like I said, I have a boy, so, um... I like blue hearts because <laughs> I don't really do pink or anything like that on his layouts but I think to add like a feminine touch of um, hearts to a layout but making it blue makes it all right <laughs> I guess on a boy layout but that one I love um, let's see so that's my collection first drawer <laughs> second drawer is another um these were for my recent haul um i haven't undone them because i want to group them also but um i love that arrows one um this is like the boy crazy ones more um stars i love this some some are studio calico um i got from studio calico kits like i think these were from the studio Cal i really love this one the smile all over. I believe this is Freckled Fawn. And it just says smile all over. And then I also love the camera one. 
and these were from Studio Calico. Um, I love this, sorry, this one that just says happy birthday. And I use washi not only um, on layouts, on Project Life, um, but I love putting this, like sealing an envelope with the happy birthday for a birthday card, or I love sealing like cards that I make and then I put like those clear cellophane bags. Um, I use this to hold uh, hold it down um, or just envelopes, packages. I just put, you know, washi all over it and adds a really nice touch to it. Here are all the Hello Kitty ones over here. And so, yep, I've got a whole bunch. Music notes and these are all the October afternoon ones. Uh, here, the numbers, um, the mustache one, and I'm really liking the wide washies now. I'll show you in my layout. Um, what else? So the third row is just what's um, my recollections, um, uh, ones that I recently got. So that's my washi um, collection. Let me just leave you with something pretty to look at. But here, here are the questions again. Let me see. So I already answered the favorite, my washi. I showed you my washi, I, my favorite washies, um, my most recent favorite washies. Like I said, the wide ones I'm really getting into. My least favorite, oh, even though I said I like this one um, from Glitz, it doesn't stick as well. I think I don't think it's washy. I think this is just tape. <laughs> so maybe this shouldn't be in the video. <laughs> but I wanted to show it. But yeah, it's not as sticky. I like washies that are washies that um oops that actually when you peel it off, it doesn't stick to the paper. I like that um that I can peel it up off and not tear anything. It won't stick. And I, I think that's what true washi should do. Um, let me see. What's the most expensive washi you have? Or the most you've ever paid? The most I've ever paid, I think, was early on. Um, I try to keep them about 2 or $3 each sometimes. I love bargains, so I really look for anything under 2 So a lot of times when they come in packs, sometimes it's worth it. Um, but I think the most I paid is maybe $5 for one early on. I don't even remember which ones, you know, were $5. It might have been like the Chevron ones. These were some of the ones I first got to, or it was like, um, anywhere from 4 to $5 each. So, um, that's that. Um, I really like my Target ones. <laughs> I use those a lot too, and they were probably, they were probably the cheapest because they come... And like a, was it a four pack or a five pack? And it's like, it equals like a dollar each. So that's one of my favorites. And I guess the most bang for your buck. That's why it's my favorite. And that, how do I store my washi tapes? So this is how I store it in a drawer on a cart. And I have these. These are perfect, uh, I think. These bins. And these are just plastic bins. I think I got t either two of them for a dollar or one of them for a dollar at the dollar store. Dollar Tree, specifically. Um, and what else? Now, show your favorite um, layout. And it's actually a new layout I wanted to show you. And here it is. Oop. Let's see if you can see it. Okay. Um, this is part of the block party, I believe, one of my Studio Calico kits. Um, so the, this is, of course, my son, so I use the washi. Like I'm saying, I like the wide because I'll tear it in half, and it has that wave look. So I put it here, I put it here. I also put the smile, like I said, that was um, the Freckles Fawn one, here and here. And then, um, so you can see the the letters the title better I put down um, this black camera one so it kind of acts as a mat for my title so I did it that way and um, I like putting washi to kind of 
kind of get rid of the straight lines. I'm, a lot of my scrapbooking is pretty much very um, neat and um, clean, but I think just by adding this this um, strip of washi here, which was from the Studio Calico one, um, which drawer is it? This drawer, sorry. Um, this one, which has the ombre effect. So it really kind of gave that fade look to it and kind of, uh, uh, I don't know, a softer look to the page. Um, so that is my layout. Um, and basically, <laughs> this is just pictures of my son. I was trying to take passport photos for him and ends up, he's traveled more than I ever did, you know, in my, you know, he's only, he'll turn three this month and he's traveled more than I have when I was like in my thirties. <laughs> so we're really spoiling him with that. And he's a good traveler, um, sometimes, <laughs> but, um, most of the time he's pretty good. So that's that. Um, I'll probably show another video just showing my layouts and then go into this in more detail. But this one has all my washi on it. So, hope this helps. Thank you so much, Nadine, for tagging me. And, um, let me show you my washi. There you go. Um, so that's that. Um, if you guys have any questions about anything, feel free to comment. I love all your comments. And, um, and all my new subbies. I'm getting so many more. Yay! But welcome all subbies um, and old. Um, hi to all the old ones. So um, hope everyone's having a great Friday and have a great weekend. Bye.